Like many others, Geneva Worth took to the internet to do some job hunting, and she found one. Or at least she thought she did. It, it hit me really hard, more than I expected it was going to do. I thought my, I thought it was going to go real great and well, and it really didn't. What happened? The scammer sent her a check for nearly $2,800 to use for equipment. She was instructed to buy it and send three separate money grams back to the so-called employers. She did just that, only to get a call from the bank several days later, saying the check she had bounced and she owed the bank nearly $3,000. Two bank officials that I spoke with here in Brownwood said that once you deposit a check, you're liable to pay that money back. They say that if it sounds too good to be true, it probably is. Worth had to take out a loan to pay the bank. I feel upset, you know, about it. You know, I cried for days and days because I was like, man, it felt like I made the mistake. I should have known better. But everybody makes mistakes. We spoke to Keith Clark at Citizens National Bank. He says, unfortunately, scams like this are all too common. His advice is this. You've got to understand that there's not going to be money coming, falling out of heaven and landing in your lap. And uh, it's, it's too bad because a lot of people have been hurt. In Brownwood, Joshua Piguero, K-Texas News.